Have you ever imagined that a private company could land on the moon? Well, guess what? Firefly Aerospace just did it. Based in Texas, USA, Firefly Aerospace has made history by becoming the first private firm to successfully land a spacecraft on the moon. A major milestone in the journey of space exploration. Their lunar lander is called Blue Ghost, and it safely landed on the moon's surface on March 2nd, 2025, in a region known as Mare Crisium. The mission is called Blue Ghost Mission 1. It was launched on January 15th, 2025, aboard a Falcon 9 rocket. Yes, the same rocket owned by SpaceX. The spacecraft traveled 5 million kilometers to reach the moon, making this a truly historic achievement. Blue Ghost carried 10 scientific instruments from NASA designed to study the moon's surface, measure its internal heat, and observe how solar energy affects the moon. The mission will last about 14 Earth days, which equals one lunar day. After that, darkness will fall over the landing site and the lander will stop functioning. This is a big deal because until now, only government space agencies have achieved such landings, like the Soviet space program, NASA China's CNSA India's ISRO, and Japan's JAXA. Many private companies have tried, but failed. For example, in February 2024, another private lander called Odysseus did reach the moon, but it tipped over and failed to operate. Firefly's success is the beginning of a new chapter in space exploration. It proves that private companies can now work alongside national space agencies. Now let's talk about private space companies in India. India too allows private companies to participate in space exploration. With government support through bodies like InSpace, Indian National Space Promotion and Authorization Center, private firms can now collaborate with ISRO and even use its facilities. Here are some of the top private space companies in India. Skyroot Aerospace. They build affordable launch vehicles. In fact, they launched India's first private rocket Vikram S in November 2022. Agnikul Cosmos. They're focused on small satellite launchers, like Agnaban, which can carry up to 300 kilograms to a 700 kilometer orbit. Pixel specializes in making high-tech satellites that take images of Earth. Bellatrix Aerospace works on rocket engines and satellite tech. These companies are now a major force in India's growing space ecosystem, and the success of Blue Ghost inspires them, and others, to dream bigger, to go beyond the moon, to Mars, and maybe even beyond that. Now it's quiz time. Let's see how much you remember. What is the name of Firefly Aerospace's lunar lander? A. Moonrunner B. Blue Ghost C. Ghost Rider D. Lunar Hawk Where did the Blue Ghost land on the moon? A. Oceanus Procellarum B. Mare Tranquillitatis C. Mare Crisium D. Tycho Crater Which company owns the Falcon 9 rocket? A. NASA B. SpaceX C. Isro D. Firefly What was India's first private rocket called? A. Agnabon B. Vikram S C. Sky 1 D. Prithvi X. What does Pixel specialize in? A. Rocket engines. B. Lunar landers. C. Earth imaging satellites. D. Moon rovers. 